Bohemians in the green and black have been struggling to score goals lately and that's what happened last Friday. Carl Moore had their first chance, denied by Dara Doyle. Great defending that by the Drogheda player. Bobby Horgan's side have been struggling lately, but they had their attacking moments too. Eric Foley's astute pass putting Carl Brady through. He rounded Dean Delaney, but he was denied by the upright. Very unlucky. This game would drive a manager to drink, but Bowes continued to dominate. Paddy Kavanagh, their most creative player. Anto Murphy playing his first league game of the season. Forced Dave Ryan into action. Fine save by the former St. Pat's keeper. From the corner, Dave Mulcahy got the better of Gary O'Neill, but Jason Byrne missed the chance in a game where the first goal was always going to be vital. Bohemians had most of the chances as they continued to take the game to Drogheda. Byrne made his presence felt but Moore's shot was scrambled away. It's going to be a long and frustrating season for the Bowes fans if they can't take scoring chances, and they've certainly been dominating matches lately. Kavanagh's cross, giving Byrne his best opening of the game, and again it was Ryan to the rescue. It was almost inevitable that the County Loud side would get their opportunities, and it was O'Neill who set up Foley. His shot well saved by Delaney. The only goal of the game must have had Owen Heary tearing his hair out. Stephen Beatty with the mistake. That dangerous pass gave Carl Walsh the chance. And he took it superbly. It's a first league win in seven for Drogheda. Bows have now gone seven without a win. Delight with the three points, first and foremost. Um, wasn't a great performance, but it was a hard work and disciplined performance. And, you know, at half time, we had to reorganise a little bit. You know, we losing the player after about 10, 15 minutes didn't help. We're down to the bare bones as it is. So it's a great three points. All credit to, to Drogheda. They took that chance when he came along and put it in the back of the net. And as I said, that's, that's what won the game for them. It was a mistake from us and, and they capitalised on it. Whereas ourselves, we had a couple of chances and we just couldn't get the ball in the net. And that's probably been our problem over the last couple of weeks.